In today's video, we're going to talk a little bit about timing here. And I want to give you the heads up in Netflix, because Netflix, you know, has been uh, giving us a nice rally since the December 26th low, along with, you know, some of the other stocks. But I have a little bit of a concern right here where you probably want a put to put a stop maybe underneath this recent low, and I'll show you why. If I run the timing histogram from that last low, it shows me standout time resistance the 12th through the 14th. Okay, that's this right here. So that means there's time resistance to the move. Now that doesn't mean that the market's going to roll over and die for sure, but it is time resistance, so you want to be aware of it and you want to ratchet up stops, right? So that's the first thing. You know, we have the histogram. Okay, and that's what it looks like right underneath the chart. So we have that time resistance, plus we have some of the outright cycles that I want you to be aware of. Now, there's a, a major uh, high to high, 1272 come in on February 12th. There is, um, let's see, another high to high, recent high to high, 618 comes in the 12th. And then there's a major low to low where 1272 comes in on the 14th. So I'm going to use the 12th, 14th as a time window for a possible reversal. And I don't want you to assume that it's definitely going to kick in, but what I do want you to do is um, ratchet up your stops just in case. Okay, so maybe to have them, well, if this is too far away uh, for you, then, you know, maybe you keep them even tighter. But, you know, just via the, the daily chart, that looks like kind of a natural place to have a stop underneath. So let's keep an eye on the timing cycles via both the histogram in Netflix and also the outright cycles and see if we start to see any um, reversal indications against 